In, in mathematical studies, most numerical answers needed to be rounded off to three significant figures. So, round the following numbers correct to three significant figures. So we've got 567,293 and 0.004052. Right, this illustrates there's two things that we need to indicate here. Here we have a number and here we have a decimal where, it, uh, where there's a zero at the beginning. So let's just have a look. A, 5672... Nine, three. We have to identify the first significant figure, which is the 5, the second significant figure, which is the 6, and the third significant figure, which is the 7. So we'll draw a line in there. Now 2 is less than 5, therefore it has no effect on the 7. However, the 2, the 9 and 3 will need to be replaced with zeros. So the answer will be 5, 6, 7, 0, 0, 0 to 3 significant figures. Don't forget to replace these three figures here with zeros. B. 0 0.0040352 Now when dealing with decimals where there's a zero in the front here and some zeros at the front here, it's important to realise that these three zeros here are not significant. The first significant figure of this is a four. The second, this zero is significant. And then the third is 3. So we'll draw a line in here. We've got 5, which is greater or equal to 5. So that 5 will make a that 3 a 4. Now the 5 and the 2 now completely disappear. So we do not need to replace them with any zeros or anything like that. They just don't need to appear in the answer. So the correct answer will be 0 0.0040. And that final 3 here becoming a 4 to 3 significant figures. So this has been a video to show you how to round whole numbers and decimals to three significant figures.